Hey guys, thanks for coming back to my channel. Um, today I'm going to make musk, confectionery musk that is. Um, this is like pure pink nostalgia to me. I absolutely love this stuff. And I learned how to make it a little while ago and it's actually quite straightforward. I was surprised how easy it is actually and I use it a lot and keep it around because it's delicious. Mm. Five ingredients in musk, half a kilo pure ice and sugar, liquid glucose, musk essence from your cake shop and while you're there get three leaves of gelatin and for color use this gelatin goes into cold water first and it becomes soft by the time you need it next step is color your water you can use beetroot like I have here with a bit of boiling water or you can use plain water with a few drops of food colouring. From here, everything but the sugar goes into the pot in certain amounts. Um, I'll post the recipe at the end of this clip. The coloured water is in there, the flavour is in there. Check that out, that's cool. Now the glucose. And finally, your gelatin. Squeeze the water out of this, you don't need it. In it goes. Now, all of that weighs 150 grams. Dissolve it, and then into your bowl. That's it. Okay, from here, I've got my half kilo of pure ice and sugar, and I add about a third, and then I whisk it for three minutes. And then I repeat this step three times. So the next third goes in, and then I whisk it again. What this does is it dissolves the sugar really thoroughly so you get a nice smooth texture. If you don't whisk it enough, it'll be grainy and sandy. There you have it, it's become quite stiff and awesome looking. Now from here, all we need to do is dry this stuff out and you've got the finished product. I like piping mine out because you can do a few different things with it. Nom nom musk. Okay, I'll point out now, you don't have to use a piping bag, but it's an option if you feel like having a crack at it. It's a lot of fun. It's good piping practice. Otherwise, just get a little splodge on the end, get your spatula, and you can just do this. So that's it, you let it dry overnight. Let it dry for a couple of days if it needs it. Um, in a cool dark place. Now if you want crispy musk, you use liquid glucose. If you want crumbly musk or soft musk, you use powdered glucose. I discovered that one by accident. Now get on it. This is so good. Don't forget to subscribe, Jack. Oh, oh man.